Hey guys, Rorius here. Welcome back to Abe's Exodus. Now, where did we get up to? We got up to Boneworks, didn't we? Yeah, here we are. Okay. So, I believe we've made it a huge way through already. In what, four episodes, I think? Yeah. In this area, we're just turning off the electricity. Ugh. Ugh. No, I knew it. I was like, nah, no way. That was way too slow. Shit. <laughs> okay, let's quick save it right here. Oh, it's such a close freaking margin. Um, what the hell were we doing last time exactly? We went through Fico Depot, didn't we? We went through the Fico Depot area, and we went through the start of Boneworks. Um, we might have also even finished off the end of Scribania. Not Scarabania, the, the Madanshi vaults. Uh, and then, can I, oopsies. Can I reach that top platform from here? I cannot. This area is just constant noise. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, well, well. Okay, let's take it easy. Ugh. Oh my god. Uh, okay, that brings that thing on the right hand side of the screen down. We can get a rock, or sorry, a, a bone from here. I think, I think last time one of the things that I was doing was I was talking about how I love the environment design in this space. Okay, wait, wait, wait. There we go. Okay, we got this guy following us now. Uh, I believe we just have to take him over here. Uh, wait. Okay. Yeah. And we'll be back. I should go up to the top way. Yeah, I have to go up to the top way. Oh, can I go straight up from here? I cannot. Damn it. <laughs> eh. 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 <laughs> there we go. We've got these other two guys as well. And I'm gathering them together because... Well, well, you'll see. You'll see. Oh. Damn it. There we go. That's right. I forgot you could actually do that. I think I could have done that in a previous episode in an area, but I didn't because I forgot that it was a thing. Ugh. Come this way, and then come this way. I think that's it. I think for now that's all I need to do. Okay, I need five. I knew it was here. I knew there was a shrine call here, but I didn't remember how many I needed. I need five. Right. I think I need this for some Mudokans will come up this end of the room over here. So, uh, leave that down for now because I need to go like this? No, that takes me back up. My bad. Oh, down here. Yeah. Yeah, and this is a crazy moment. I can't actually get to them, I don't believe, from here. Like, I don't believe if even if I run jump, I won't make it across. But you see those little bottles in the foreground, and the like pile of bone dust coming up the side there. Well... <laughs> yeah. That's a thing. Okay, wait, wait. Oh, that's a... that's a Mudokan one. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let's quick save it. Oh. oh, that was that was just that one. No, no. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Oh, I thought he was dead. I so thought he was dead. Oh my God. Oh. You come back. No, 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 no. Uh. Wait. Hi. Um. Nope. <laughs> uh. <laughs> the freaking slowest moving drills ever. I should take him through one bit at a time. Oh, I did that again. Oh, that works. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I freaking fell. Hi. You will follow me. Okay. Ugh. 
so stressful. Oh, and because I didn't pull the, the lever... <laughs> the middle drill's not even running anymore. That, that lever at the top lift uh, activates the middle drills. <laughs> this makes it real easy. Oh, man. <laughs> Freaking awesome. And that takes me to... Oh, no, what the... Oh, I thought it took me to the other side. Oh. <laughs> okay. No, it does not reach. <laughs> oh, it's probably the lever at the top there. So if I... But how the hell do- oh, I have to go- I have to fall down that way. Okay. Um... Wait. Yeah. Wait. Work. <laughs> Just stay there. Stay there. I need to fall down over the other side of the screen. I forgot- see, some of the formations of these puzzles, I forget that how they work. It's just been such a long time since I played the game that, like, I remember the, the areas, I remember this location, like, the back of my hand. But the, um, okay, maybe not like the back of my hand, but I remember it very well. Uh, but the, oh, and then pull this. Just to get rid of that. <gasps> <laughs> but, like, the actual solutions and stuff, I often forget. So we actually have, we actually have six. We only need five, but we have six. That's fine. Uh, before I save these guys, come over here and just wait. wait. I have to, uh, do a thing. <laughs> oh, shut up. I have to get this down so these guys can actually make it. Go up here, and then back down. And we can save them all. We can save them all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yee. I believe you just do it here, don't you? Because you just need to get rid of all the mines and shit. I think. Don't you? Let's just do it here. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we can get across here. Because we couldn't get down here due to all the mines down here. Yeah, I believe that's it. Do I just save all three of these guys? And that's it? Yeah, <laughs> it's cool. I'm so unsure of myself. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, let's get through this door. Yeah, all the, like, annex ends that lead to, uh, you know, if, this, if you go through this door, you will not be able to return. They always freak me out. Even though there are areas, there are actually areas like that in, there's plenty of areas like that in Ape's Odyssey as well. That's not labeled as such, and so my anxiety isn't as high on that game. Cool. Boneworks Bulletin. Bone production marches on. It has come to my attention that... <laughs> I'm not going to do it in his voice. <laughs> I briefly was like, oh, I'll do it. It's that Abe guy. It has come to my attention that some employees believe that Boneworks can be shut down by turning off the five main boilers. Rubbish. <laughs> this filthy lie is spurious. Reprehensible and completely untrue. Furthermore, any employees who turns off all five work wells and shuts down the Boneworks will be immediately downsized. So yeah, it's like, it doesn't downsize it. Also, if you do downsize it by doing that, oh... <laughs> Oopsies. Yeah, so immediately they show their own hand. Oh god. Yeah, so we have to start with. Well, we. This is like a zoo lag. This is a bit like a zoo lag where you got. Uh. Four. I think. You got four doors, but one of them's locked. And, uh. It leads to. So there's like. There's three trials that lead to a fourth trial that's locked. Um. I'm gonna start with one. We go numerically. Sorry, um... No, numerically is the correct term. 
For some reason, for a brief second there, I thought I said alphabetically. But whatever the case, let's start with one. Yeah, so we're, the aim of this is we're going to Boneworks with the intention of shutting it down, definitely, but the main reason being that we want to get to direct a flag. Um, oh, I managed to sneak past them. Do I still have a rock? I still have a, not a rock, a um, bone. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Was that just the easiest freaking thing ever? I don't think I need to keep doing that. Let's just wait for that to stop. Yeah, because that shuts down all the machines. Cool. Oh, I'm gonna just quickly check. There aren't... There aren't any secrets anywhere near, are there? There's no green bottles anywhere. Huh. I don't know why that drill's still on, but this one's off. And all these ones are off. Yeah, that's already one boiler shut down. <laughs> Let's head into the second one. Okay, I still have a bone. Let's, um, I think the bone, the idea of the bone is that it works as meat and as a rock. That's what the, oh, nine, yes. That's what the idea of having the, the rocks, or the, having the, um, bones was. I feel like they work ever so slightly differently, but, nope. I tried to do that thing again where I... Um, let's see if, if I can, like, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, the, having the, having the... I need more. Having the bones double as both food and something that can destroy. Oh. That's plenty. Wonderful. Let's just destroy this while we can. Quick save it. God damn it. <laughs> I can't destroy this one that's close to me. Well that's plenty, once again. Plenty. I can get over these. As long as I don't have to run suddenly. Oh, god damn it, so many mines. <laughs> oh, there's a secret in this room. Ah, uh, okay. Good to know. What's the bit? It's... Uh, damn it. Shit. Shit, man. That killed me? I was on a different level than the mine, though. Weird, I've never seen that before. Oh. Well, it's, okay, it's below me. I thought it was actually to the right. I thought the secret was to the right. Good thing I accidentally did that, like an idiot. Okay, can I, like... No. I need to destroy the mine, but I'm too close to it. I'm probably gonna have to go like this. Uh, I need more rocks, or I need more bones, please. I'm gonna call them rocks, like, every time, and I'm gonna correct myself, like, every time. I do apologize if that's irritating. <laughs> uh, oh dear. <laughs> okay. There we are. This should be plenty of distance. This was too close last time. So I'm gonna go up here and do a... Perfect! Okay. Before we go down there... I just wanted to- oh, I can't- God damn it! And my freaking hair just keeps falling on my face. If I had allowed it to- If I had gone like that, I was one block off. 
God Bye. damn it. Okay. Way to be irritating. <laughs> Apes Exodus. Oh. Okay. So I have... There's 31 in the Boneworks, but I did not remember how many I had before I came into Boneworks, so... We're just gonna have to go with it. I might be able to- I might be able to check it against a guide. Uh, let's check this wall. I thought this was where the secret was. I thought it was against this wall. I was mistaken. Still have five bones. Oh, I can't destroy them from here. Damn it! <laughs> so many mines! <laughs> so irritating. Okay, let's just- one by one. Okay, that's those ones. I have two left. God damn it. Jet. You're kidding me. It won't give me a rock. It won't give me a bone because there's already a bone on the floor. Because I threw that bone and it did not blow up. Oh my god. Please say I can jump over that and... I, I should be able to, it's three. I... I swear, I pressed R1, I pressed left, and then I pressed jump, and it just did the one... You only responded to the jump. Oh, I haven't got the secret yet, have I? Yeah, there's something they did in this game is they... I mentioned it in one of the previous episodes, but they gave all the Blue Dawkins different voices. So, there's just like a... It's the same voice, but it's like a, a slider of like how deep their voice is, and that determines- oh, that's right. <gasps> okay, this time. Okay, good. I got most of them. And I didn't have to glitch it out. I didn't- I said glitch it out. I didn't put myself in a freaking corner this time. I can't believe I pressed- I ran and jumped and it just didn't do the run. Cool. I believe I've got everything here. I just have to wait for the door. I'm kind of salty now. <laughs> this level, this particular room has been super not kind to me. Oh, that was lucky. I thought the drill was going to kill me for sure. Cool. So boiler number th three and four are in this space. I do already have nine bone. up here. Okay, this is one of them. I think I can just walk this one. That's three. Yeah, and those, those things in the background with the eyes that have like the three and the four in them. I don't know what they are. There's some kind of boiler thing, but I love that they're faces. I don't know why, but I love that there's a whole lot of things with faces in this game. Like the uh, Gluckin trains will have faces and shit. Oh god. I didn't mean to press up. It just happened. You're fucking kidding me. See, there's one even in this room. With the two behind it. The one in the background there. <laughs> okay, again. <laughs> this game has been very successful immediately of making me super salty. But like, that's the thing, is that... I think, um... In places where you read about Abe's Exodus, I, I even said it when I first started playing Abe's Exodus, like, firstly, this game is a lot harder than Abe's Odyssey, generally speaking. Um, but also, this part of the game gets a lot harder than the previous part. Oh, they could get me from there. Okay, that's good to know. I wasn't sure. I thought I'd be high enough that I could stay away from this log. Oh my god, I didn't quick save it. <laughs> Fucking idiot, Rory. Okay, what I should do is I should try and get their attention while I'm still down here. Hi. 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 Oh my god, he went for me instead of the bone. Why wasn't he going for the bone? Did I- 
Did I seriously not quick save it? I swear I quick saved it. What the fuck? I swear I quick saved it. Yeah, straight away I'm just gonna quick save it before I do anything. So I'm that's a hundred percent guaranteed that I have quick saved it. Turn this off again. Quick save it. <laughs> Quick save it again, okay. 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 I just threw a bunch of bones. <laughs> I was not having that. Okay. I was not letting that, that shit happen again. Okay, now we're in the background of this area to turn off the four. And all the drills turn off. Yeah. Yeah, it's all the... I think they refer to it as the boilers. Um, they're basically what's powering the facility. The Boneworks grinding facility. Oh, my ears. Why is it, is it so loud in this version? I don't understand. Um, I swear it wasn't that loud in the PlayStation version, but it, I could be wrong. Oh. Okay, once again, quick save. This is the last of the five boilers. Wait, what? There was sleeping slogs in there, right? Whatever. <laughs> I thought they were gonna chase me. Well, there's that. <laughs> I did get chased, just not by the ones that I thought I was gonna be, be chased by. Ah, here we go, here we go. This is the cool part. This is the part that I've been waiting for. Oh, this is really tough though. I think I can stop if I go here. Yeah, I just had to time it for that. Wait, if I go back, if I go back, I can't. There weren't bottles in that last screen, were there? I was gonna let myself die, because I'm... I'm concerned. I don't want to miss Mudokins. Okay, no, there were no, there's no secret here. No bottles. Yeah, that's something we're coming to very soon. But let's read this, well, let's watch this. Oh no, it's not a- oh, I thought it was one of the cutscenes. <laughs> Boneworks Bulletin. Boneworks shuts down. Or Boneworks shut down. Boneworks, enemy number one, shoot on sight. Yeah. So we shut down- we shut down, um, Boneworks. I don't know how that bulletin was made so fast. <laughs> but we already- we shut- God damn it, normally they can't shoot through those. But I- I did not have a plan for the- God damn it. I did not have a plan for what to, what to do next. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I shut down the boilers and, and that shut down the facility. So, the facility's been shut down. But, um... Oh god. Uh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Uh. Okay. This is a cool bit. See? This is a Glockin. This is Director Flag. The guy in the back, in the picture in the back is this, is this Glockin here. Let's just read this really quick. Boneworks Bulletin. Safety first. And then this tells you how to, how to, well, tool slicks. When I face you, listen up. When I say stay here, wait for my command. Kill him means shoot. Do it means pull a lever or platform, or platform rope. Get it? Got it? Good. Yeah. So, let's do this. Let's fucking do this. <laughs> okay, wait, 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 wait. Uh, I think I can take them both with me, can't I? Uh, uh, there we go. <laughs> 
Okay, and that other one's staying back there, I think. Uh, I'm gonna remind myself of the commands. Wait. <laughs> uh. <laughs> so, basically, much like... Okay, I'm gonna walk through here while he's waiting there. I'm gonna remind myself of the buttons. Basically, you have the same sort of, like, you, c you can command slugs like slugs command slogs. Um, you have the, hey, come here, stay here, and do it, which is basically the same as Abe, where it's, you know, hello, follow me, wait, work. And then you got the, all yours, which is the same. And then you got the laugh, which is one that I miss. <laughs> you have a help button, which is different, that's new to the Glocken. And you have kill him, like a uh, Slig has the, get him. So yeah, let's do this. This is a this is a this is a bit and a half. <laughs> yeah, for whatever reason, for whatever reason, the slogs in this facility will attack a Glocken on sight. So, yeah. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Wrong button. Hey, hey. What? Do it. Yeah. There's a Glocken Gates. <laughs> hey. Uh one second. Do it. <laughs> this is really hard. Well it can, it can be really hard. Because you're dealing with an NPC. Oh god. No! Damn it! No, I failed. Yeah. Shit. If if Flag dies at any point, that's like immediately spawns. Damn it! I should have I should have quick saved it. So this is the premise of this section. <laughs> I love playing as the Gluckins. I don't know why. I just love it. I love the way they move. <laughs> I love like moving them around. It's so fascinating. It's so fun. Um, okay, stand next to no no. Yep, stand right there. Um, no, I have to do this quickly. So we say do it. Okay. Oh, okay, quick save it. <laughs> and you can always yell for help. help. And you'll always spawn a new slig. Um, but then I'll go... Oh. Oh my god. Let's just go over here and say... Because if you stand in front of the slig, I believe they shoot you. Okay. We're, we're geared. We're ready. <laughs> Okay. Okay. <laughs> come here. Just come here, for God's sake. Turn around. <laughs> Hopefully he'll just turn around automatically. Yeah, the drill slowly come towards you. Okay, okay. He's gonna come here? Okay, good, good, good. Oh, uh, quick save it. Do it. Do it. Come here. Come here. You don't actually have to say hey, I don't believe. As soon as you just like bark an order at a, at a slug, they'll come and do the thing for you. Um, that's the whole deal with Gluckens. They, they can't do these things themselves. They don't have arms, so they can't pull levers. They can't activate those things. They have slug uh, chauffeurs that do things for them. Hey. the rough one. Ugh. 
it, you just make it through in time. <laughs> okay. I think it was only really, really rough back in the day because we never, I never used to quick save. Well, I used to forget to quick save all the time, just like we have at the start of the round. I'm glad we started, but we did, because it reminded me. Reminded me that I needed to uh, quick save. So yeah. <laughs> Disarm the main guide! Do it, you idiots! Gotcha! Um, um, I like how, um. Yeah, as soon as you deactivate it, Abe, like, chants out of him. And he explodes! <laughs> and so but that means he's dead as well. Uh, do I just go through here? I think I do. I shouldn't have waited for so long to decide that. Because we're on a time limit. <laughs> I love that. Oh god, I only have eight seconds. I'm gonna die. Oh. Yeah, see, I waited too long. <laughs> I need to just freaking do it. Just do it. Oh. <laughs> Damn it, see, those... There's little things in the background that, that I was suspicious of in Abe's Odyssey. Uh, I think they're used in Abe's Odyssey as well, just in the ending sequence. Um, uh, yeah, those those are the gas like timer things that you always see. Oh, um, how do you do that? Can I just do that without killing the slobs? I think I could probably do that faster if I just don't kill the slogs. Yeah, so the security phones are used to turn off the um, the security gates and stuff like that. Yeah, there we go. It's much faster and more logical. Freaking sweet. Oh, wait. There we go. Get this guy down, down up there. I think that's all nine. It's <laughs> all nine of them right there. Yeah, perfect. Wait, is there... What did that activate? Oh no, I activated something back. Back the other side. The sound thing is still a thing in this game where like you hear stuff on the right that's actually on the left. I don't know why. But yeah, we're back in freaking... But I don't know why you just get portaled back here. You really should have to take the train back. Because you take a train there, you know. Um, but yeah, we come back to Fico Depot. <laughs> and uh, now we're gonna head off to some barracks. Well, what we'll do, and the, all the things have been reset here, so you have to do this again. Oh right, I need to get another fart. <laughs> yeah, so that's why. Um, if, actually, if we go down here now, um, most things are still the same. But if you go through here, there's one less electricity barrier here because the boneworks one is now turned off, or uh, well, turned on, I guess, depending on how you look at it. Um, and if we go hop down here real quick, the way to the Fico Depot executive office also has one missing electrical barrier now. All I need to do for this part is destroy these mines that are in the next room, and then I can make my way over to Sleep Barracks. Perfect! <laughs> there we are. I don't need any farts after that. I still love that you can see the Rupture Farms door and the Vikers Lab door. So cool. Now I know I did it before we went to Boneworks, but I uh, need to just make sure that it still is the case. Because it's been reset, probably. See? I'm glad I did. You can turn off the electrical barrier to the Slick Barracks area. And then, uh, yeah, and then we can go through there, sneak our way past all the million Slicks. I, I can. I'm just gonna go straight across like that. <laughs> Wait, is there, is there a secret here? There's no green bottles, so no, I'm gonna just run for it. <laughs> okay. Now we're in the 
on the path to Slick Barracks area. Uncle Arslex, tourist tip number six. <laughs> Only Slicks can use Slick voice locks, yeah. That's pretty well, that's pretty well explained already, I think. But yeah, we got our first introduction to playing as a Glucken, which is one of my favorite things about this game. Just the gl whole Glucken thing. Oh, that's right, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> there we go. See, depending on which um, voice one you go to, if you go to one of the Glucken ones, it goes, <laughs> if you try and say hi to it. Uh, the slick ones that go, Burr, as though you've said something wrong. Uh, yeah, let's go up here. I believe this is just a way you can see all the slags, all the security on the way to slick barracks. Uh, flying slags, walking slags, anti-chant. Uh, but thankfully, there's one of these for some reason. I don't know why there's one of these, but I know that in the slick barracks area there are more of these, so it's it's good that you have shown that they're here again. So yeah, you turn off the little electrical barrier at the end there. And go on your way with your invisibility circle. <laughs> uh, okay. So yeah, as you run past them all, they're like, what? They can hear you, but they can't see you. Ugh. It's <laughs> so close. I think they can still come up here, can't they? One of the flying slags comes up here, I think. Does he? Maybe not. Can I... Let's, um... Oh, thank God. <laughs> Let's just uh, make our way slowly up here. And we've got a little slick disp dispenser, which is a thing that only appears the one time in Abe's Odyssey, but is a thing more often in this game. Mainly because of the Gluckens. You have slick dispensers for the Glucken purposes. Down, up. <laughs> Yeah, so you got the the laugh is at the end now. As I said in Abe's Odyssey, they have they use the laugh as a delimiter for the end of the sequence, so you're not waiting for it to end. Yeah, this is why. Oh, I managed to destroy both flying slags. Yeah, this is why um <laughs> you have a slag dispenser and not just a, uh, a singular slag to work with. Oh, <laughs> that's not what I meant to have happen, but whatever the case, <laughs> let's get another guy. <laughs> I was looking for... That's what I was looking for. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, this is already up. Yeah, there's often levers right next to these things, just to say that, you know, uh, you can recall it. Down up. Oh. I even said down up when I. Up, down. Yeah. So, yeah, we got these little sequences now. <laughs> uh, yeah. The platforms are very specifically designed in that area so that you can't take the slick outside of that space. Yeah, you don't even need the teleporter as Abe, because Abe can just climb. <laughs> Oh god, don't fall to death. There we go. And I believe this is where the this is the train to frickin' Slick Barracks. Yeah. <laughs> I love the trains. I love the trains. I love the like I've I've said this so many times, like I'm I'm such a, I'm such a broken record about this game. The visual design and shit. I just love everything about it. I love that the trains look a bit like a Glocken. You know? They look like a, a bit like a Glocken head. <laughs> Flying around, you know? I feel like it makes sense for what the Glockens are like. They want to put themselves on everything, you know? They think of themselves pretty highly, so... Having their faces on shit just makes sense. This is an interesting area. This is the Slick Barracks. It's such a fascinating space. <laughs> it's just tents. Lots and lots and lots of tents everywhere. With like, big facilities as well. I'm not 100% what everything is. 
Oops, I rolled one extra time that I was not supposed to roll. That's why I quick saved it. <laughs> okay. We'll go a little bit into this. We'll just, we'll get, we're in block zero at the moment. Oh, <laughs> maybe I'm supposed to go through. I know you're supposed to, I don't think I can climb up because that electrical barrier will kill me. Damn it! What are you supposed to do here? I don't understand. Can I jump straight up from where I'm from where the lever is? Okay, I can. I did. I didn't think I could. I thought I was one back from it for some reason. I do that a lot though. <laughs> I remember these areas pretty well because they're really, they're like, they're super challenging, um, but they also, they have very specific sequenced movements. Okay, this one's really hard. Oh, pretty sure that's how you have to, no, 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 no. Ugh. <laughs> it's such a tight ugh, set of movements. Yeah, we're slowly climbing up one of these like slick barracks areas. You could, you could see like a bunch of the buildings in the background area. Oh, I do that a lot. Did I quick save it? I believe I quick saved it, but I'm not sure. I did. Wonderful. Good on you, Pastor Rory. Okay. He can't see me anymore. He has no way of getting to me. I think he can still see me here though. Ugh. Okay. This is a good spot to quick save as well. He'll come back up here in a minute. Yeah. I was like, can I just go straight up? <laughs> I was like, I know there's a pattern here. To do with, uh, I can, like jump across and then jump up. Or can I chant into? No, I can chant into this guy down here. Yeah. <laughs> I can actually go back. Oh no, I can't go back because this, this is in the way. But um, you can, you can kill these guys. Oh, that was close. You could accidentally kill Abe by shooting down there if you're not particularly clever about it. I totally forgot that this was how this ended. I don't know. God damn it. Okay. Ugh. As soon as you fire, it's like... There we go. That's that one. I think I need to do this one first, don't I? He's facing away. God damn it, I keep pressing circle right as I bang my head. There we go. <laughs> now he won't kill me when I'm trying to get up here. God damn it, it's so hard to get through this space as a flying slick. And then last but not least, wait. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and they, they respawn because it's easy to accidentally kill it. It also means that there's constant threat. <laughs> it's, it's like a it's, a, it's a mix of like, having the slug there, always spawning there, is like, uh, it's a constant threat. There's always a, there's always a flying slug presence. But it also means if you screw up, you know, you can have, have another go. I might leave this here because I think if we go any further, it'll be too long. Because I think we're getting already pretty far into the entrance section. And um, it's a bit like where I left off. This is a little bit like where I left off the Boneworks episode, actually. <laughs> where it's like, we're a little bit into the intro section, but we're not yet reached like a Zulag or a, um, I think they call them the 
the bunks or the dorms. I forget exactly what they're called in this particular area. In the previous one, they were the boilers. Um, I don't, did they call them? It was just Annex 8, wasn't it? Um, but it was like a zoo lag. It had four doors. Yeah, this, this one I think has a few more doors than the previous one. Uh, but yeah, we'll get to that in the next episode. In the meantime, if you like what you saw, hit like. If you want to see more from me, then subscribe. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, and until next time.